Hello Taurus, welcome to a you and them love reading. We're going to be looking at the energies between you and this person that you're thinking about or connecting with at this time. And we'll also look at how you feel about each other. And let's jump in. Spirit, any messages for Taurus regarding love? Let's see what we have for you guys. What messages do you have? For Taurus when it comes to love three of coin and the nine of wands reverse this could be as someone's ready to work on something again here maybe their walls are down maybe they are letting themselves believe again This could also be three people here with the three of coins, we'll see. The lovers reverse, Gemini energy. Wow, with the two of cups, this is definitely, I feel like a lot of you, for, for some of you, I'll say, not a lot of you, because I just got started, but for, for some of you here, there was a, uh, a breakup or separation, yet there's still love. And it's almost like maybe someone wants to work on this. For others of you, this is someone that's had regret over a choice in a partnership. Um, and I feel like they're thinking of another partnership right now. So let's see, anything else for Taurus? Wow, Six of Cups reverse. Yeah, some, someone is stuck in the past and the Queen of Swords. And they might be wanting to talk about the past or there's clarity about the past here. Tell me more. Two of Cups right in the center. I feel like right now there is some, either someone wants it, you, you're talking to this person or there's new clarity here. We'll see when I clarify, but I feel like this has to do uh, regarding something in the past and someone wanting to maybe open up again or let the guard down. Let's see, what's this Nine of Wands reverse? Tell me about this one. Nine of Wands reverse, please. For Taurus. No, oh, that's a lot. Okay, I'll take all three. Well, there you are, Taurus. Front and center, the higher font. There's another card with a three, three of cups, three people. And then the two of wands reverse. Wow, this is a very clear message. I feel like this is uh, someone, um, someone could have stepped outside of a commitment here or has made a choice with a third party. There's two stories I'm seeing. I'm seeing someone that uh, maybe they're married or in a commitment with someone else um but i feel like they're they're stepping outside of that with the two of wands reverse sometimes for me as a reader this could mean infidelity or someone that is unable to really choose a path so they go through they travel both but it could also mean that someone has made a decision regarding a third person this could be you this could be your person Tell me about this Two of Wands reverse. Why is this Two of Wands reverse? King of Wands. So I feel like this is someone that's very charismatic, uh, popular, attractive, very fiery energy here, yeah. I feel like this is someone that has chosen who they want to be with. Could be dealing with a fire sign, another Taurus. Why is the lovers reverse? Page of Pentacles reverse. I feel like there there was a. This is something that wasn't able to really take off here with the Page of Pentacles reverse. Someone wasn't able to commit to 
you or to a task, wasn't able to complete something here or is delayed. Again, with a choice, someone has made a different choice. Yeah, and I feel like there has been resistance here or they're fighting for something. There could be resistance here. Ten of Pentacles reverse. Again, I, I have I, I'm getting the sense that for a lot of you, you're dealing with someone that is already in a long term commitment or you are already in a long term commitment. And there's this other person, a third person. It could also me mean, uh, or mean or um, why can I speak English? It can also be that someone um, has another interference. It does not have to be a romantic third person. Like it doesn't have to be an interference with like another partnership. It could be a parent, a friend, a coworker, some person interfering. But with the lovers reverse, I feel like someone made the wrong choice here. It didn't, it didn't lead to anything. This could also be that there was a separation because there was no actual commitment being offered or given. I feel like you probably stood up for yourself here or someone stood up for themselves in this commitment. Tell me about the Queen of Swords. Yeah, this is clarity. This is someone seeing clearly with the Seven of Swords reverse. Something coming to the surface again. You know, I have two of Pentacles reverse, two of Swords reverse, two of Wands reverse. This could be somebody that they just could not make a decision. They just could not make a decision. They couldn't decide what they wanted. They might have tried to play both sides. Perhaps they were delayed from making a decision. Tell me more about this Queen of Swords. And I feel like there's clarity now regarding this situation. The fact that someone is unable or unwilling to make a decision. Perhaps they've made a decision here that, yeah, the star and the hermit, perhaps they had to just really think about this. Virgo energy, Aquarius energy. They had to really think about what they wanted. I feel like they withdrew to make this decision. There could have been possibly very little communication between you. I'm picturing a lot of distance here. I'm feeling a lot of distance. It could be physical, but it could, I feel like it's more like emotional. You could have been ghosted by this person, or perhaps this is someone that had to really figure things out once there was complete and total silence, or once you know they were able to remove themselves from a situation. So what are they secretly thinking or feeling about you? I'm using my Secret Moon Oracle deck. This is out now. Some of you have probably already seen it in the shop. It's linked down below. What is this person thinking or feeling when they think of Taurus Spirit? What are they thinking or feeling about Taurus, please? My heart belongs to you. I want to fix this. I keep getting the same cards for the signs that I've been doing so far. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. One more, please. How are they thinking or feeling when it comes to Taurus? I want forever with you. My heart belongs to you. I want to fix this. I want for forever. With you, bottom of the deck, I have a choice to make. This is what I'm saying. I keep seeing someone like trying to make a choice or not sure what choice to make. Chemistry, there's a strong magnetic attraction here. Separation, time apart from your partner is on the horizon and make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take separation yeah i'm see i feel like this has already happened there has been probably some separation already that has taken place here because i feel distance 
so let's see. I feel there's like distance between you. Tell me more about how they're thinking or feeling about Taurus. Tell me more, Spirit, about how they're thinking or feeling. If only my hands were just a little bit bigger. <laughs> would be so much easier tell me more about how they're thinking or feeling about Taurus how are you thinking or feeling about Taurus please the Emperor reverse Aries energy so I feel like they want to if they want to fix something or bring something into balance I feel like they feel like their hands are tied yep two of swords literally this person is um undecided or unable to make a decision of some sort yeah there needs to be a change yep there's a tower a tower i feel needs to happen here for things to move forward or progress taurus tell me more about this emperor reverse why is this emperor reverse this is someone that feels powerless Maybe they're trying to be a little too controlling of a situation. They're unable to, to bring things into balance. Yeah. This is someone who's probably, their approach is probably not the best. They're probably trying to be sneaky or do something, like maybe take advantage of a situation. And I don't think it's going to work. Yeah, the higher font reverse. I feel like this is what led to a separation or is leading to some sort of unbalance in a connection or imbalance in a connection. You could be involved here and like maybe you're just not happy with the way things are going down. Tell me more about this two of swords. What's with this indecision? I feel like this person, they're constantly going back and forth or perhaps they're just scared to make a decision. Yeah, they're waiting. They're hesitating. It's like they're waiting to make this decision. Tell me about this wheel of fortune. Your person's probably just waiting either for the right time or waiting for something to pan out before they make their decision. Yeah, they're resisting change. That's really what this is. That's what this is. They're resisting change, and in the main meantime, they're not doing what they're supposed to be doing, Taurus. Whoever this is that you're dealing with. You know, how they want to fix things, but I feel like in their mind, it's not the right time or something like that. Like, perhaps they need something it's like i need this before i can do that so there's like hesitation here there's time that's gonna like pass what are their next actions going to be what are their next actions going to be towards taurus or this connection Your next action is going to be. Five of Wands reverse. So this is about overcoming the drama. Maybe uh, bring some sort of or have some sort of reconciliation. What are your next action is going to be? nine of cups reverse i just don't see them succeeding yeah their judgment is blocked i feel like this is someone that's not really thinking things through tell me more for taurus tell me about this nine of cups reverse Queen of Swords reverse. They might not be completely open with you, or perhaps they feel like you would be a Queen of Swords reverse, like not open to this. King of Wands. King of Wands again. There might be a compromise here for someone in order to take action. Wow, the devil. Capricorn energy. I feel like someone here needs to be free and they're not the fool. You know, I feel like they want to be, have a new beginning, take a risk, a leap of faith, but right now they're in this type of 
energy, the devil. Restriction, bound, stuck. Wrong choices being made here. Tell me about the Nine of Pentacles. I think you're dealing with someone who the chemistry is probably off the charts. I heard the King of Wands that showed up twice. It's probably a lot of physical chemistry here, but for some reason there's still effort that needs to be made here. Probably someone needs to be single here. Temperance Reverse and Page of Coins. So I feel like they want to make some sort of an offer here with the Page of Coins. Um, but the timing isn't right or something's not coming together with uh, Temperance Reverse. More effort, more time is needed. Sagittarius energy. Tell me about this four of, not four, five of wands reverse, please. Let me know if this is resonating for you, Taurus. Are you dealing with someone that hasn't been able to make some sort of a decision here? Um, I'm also getting the sense that a lot of you have feel like you've been juggled or like you're like in this uh, waiting mode. King of coin reverse. I feel like there was some sort of, someone is in a commitment and then it's like, it's not doing well or they're not happy in that commitment, I feel. I feel like someone needs to be free of that. Hermit, again, you could be dealing with a Virgo, but I, I, again, I feel this sense of distance. Maybe there's not a lot of communication between you right now and someone really wants to fix this, but we need to open communication here. The sun reverse, ace of wands reverse, the bottom, five of swords reverse. Yeah, it's like they want to fix this, but it's not. I just don't see this. I don't see this being fixed in the actions of your per what your person is doing, if that makes sense. I feel like a huge tower or some sort of tower moment needs to happen here. And I feel like someone's like blocking it. Can I get one more for this seven of wands? I feel like someone's resisting change. Like you don't want things to change. They don't want a tower to fall possibly. And I feel like that's exactly what's needed here. Yeah, the emperor. See, this is someone, hmm, Aries energy. The emperor was reverse here. And then he's up right here. So this is someone who, I feel like when it comes to this connection, they want to be an emperor, but they're not. That's the change that needs to happen. They need to be an emperor and they're not. They're an emperor reverse. Knight of coin reverse. Yeah, they don't have anything to offer or give you right now. It's super slow. Almost at a standstill. And I have the two of swords at the bottom again. Otherwise, I'll leave it here. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave me a comment. Tell me you know how it's uh, resonated for you. Um, thank you for your likes, shares, and subscribes. I really appreciate it. I hope you're all doing well, and I'll see you in another video. Take care.